Welcome to PageProof, the smarter way to review anything and everything. A new proof version can be uploaded after a formal to-do list has been returned to the proof owner to be actioned, or alternatively at any time during the proof's workflow if the owner needs to stop the workflow and quickly send out a new version. In this first example, a formal to-do list has been returned. The proof owner can mark off the to-dos that have been actioned as done. Then click Upload New Version. Now drag and drop the new file on top of the proof tile. In the second example, the proof is still in its workflow. To stop the workflow and upload a new version, in the proof's info pane, click the cog icon and select Upload New Version and Yes to confirm. In the setup screen of the new version, you'll notice that the proof details are inherited from the previous version, but you can change these if you like. A version number is given to the proof, so you don't need to include this in the proof name. The new version will default to using the same workflow, but this can be changed. The options are to use the current workflow, use a different workflow template, or create a brand new workflow from scratch. Remember you can choose to edit the current workflow or workflow template if you like by switching Edit Workflow to On. When the proof has more than one version, several additional features are enabled. One of these is the Compare feature which lets you compare two versions side by side. If the proof dimensions are the same size, Smart Compare can be used to compare two versions of the proof, highlighting the differences in green for you to see. You can quickly flip between the two versions as well. If you have further questions about versions, you can ask our team via the in-app chat on your dashboard. PageProof, the smarter way to review.